Philadelphia Freedom. Good song and good enough name for a team that Liberty Bell just asking to be the Philly team and Andy Reid's team struggling on offense. 30th through the air, 29th on the ground, but sixth ranked defense. It helps when you got Champ Bailey and Lawyer Malloy back there. Well, we got Ed Reed and he's going up against Corell Buckhalter looking good in the Kelly Green uniforms, but not as good as us. Kyle Bowler is the starting quarterback, launches this one and finds Marcus Robinson, Philly in business right away here over the middle and is picked off by Keith Newman. Hello, Newman. He had two picks a couple weeks ago in Washington. Off to a good start in this one. Vic over the middle to Jeremy Shockey. Going to get just enough for the first down. Throwing again on first down. Over the middle to Anquan Bolden. Brought down at about the 20-yard line. Second down and three. The pitch out to Rudy Johnson. Going to gain about a yard on that play. Third down and two. Look out. Sacked. And Vic goes down. Going to bring out Sebastian Janikowski. From 44 yards out is good. 3 nothing show here in the early going. Able to capitalize off the early turnover. Flicks this one out. That pass batted out of the air by Jeff Ulbrich. Third down and nine. Look out for the blitz. Buck Halter somehow comes up with it and is just short of the line to gain. Punt the ball to the show. Rudy, Rudy. Six yards on that carry. Second down and four. Back, 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 back. And decides to run with it and flicks this out to Jeremy Shockey. Vegas quickly into Philadelphia territory. Vic scrambling to the left. Wide open field and brought down inside the 30 yard line. Man, that fool is dangerous with the legs. Over to Lance Moore and it falls incomplete. Third down and seven back back and finds Anquan Bolden on the curl route. Gets just enough for the first down. Backs into a sack. Same old story there. Second down and 19. Over the middle to the rookie Lance Moore. Caught at the 16-yard line. It's third down and eight. Vic. Over the middle to Jeremy Shockey. Touchdown show. Powers his way into the end zone. The tight end looking good. And everyone's got the Kurt Warner jackets out here in Philadelphia. Second down and eight. The handoff to Corell Buckhalter is going to get enough for the first. This play second and 11. This time met in the backfield by Julian Peterson. Third down and 15. Flicks this one out to fullback number 25. I figured out what his name was, but I forget what it was. 10 nothing show at the end of the first quarter. Punt the ball after it was fourth and inches. That over the middle hits the guy in the back of the head. Third down and seven. Scrambling to the left and takes an absolutely vicious hit. My goodness. And it's a three and out. Champ Bailey takes a hit. And he is injured his arm on the play. That should help our passing game out. He will not return. Man, that uniform looks slick. First down and 10. The handoff to Corell Buckhalter. Breaks a tackle. And he's off to the races. And five. Touchdown. Philadelphia Freedom throws the ball into the wall. And then it disappears underneath Buckhalter shakes off Ed Reed there. Number 20 missing the tackle. And then as Jamarius Butler and Sammy Davis diving for air. And Buckhalter with the long touchdown. I think he's an eagle in this game, right? All right, we push the wrong button. It goes to Lance Moore. Third down and 11. And throwing into a group of green jerseys. They're going to decline the holding penalty. And it's another three and out for the Las Vegas show. Kyle Bowler, hand off to Buck Halter. No big run this time. Hello, Newman. Second down and 12. Bowler going outside, batted away by Sammy Davis. Third down and 12. Bowler looking, fires, and it hits Asante Samuel right in the ass. Play action, Michael Vick, and runs into a sack. Second down and 20, less than four minutes to go in the half. Going outside, and that pass easily batted away. Third down and 20, and sacked. Not a good series there 
Fourth down and 30 is when we punted it. Bowler floats this one out and it falls incomplete. Second down and 10, play action and a lot of confusion. Runs into a vicious hit. Third down and 13. Bowler, two years pro in this game, going outside to our buddy fullback number 25. Not even close, Vegas calls a timeout. Give us that ball back, let's add to the lead. Okay, throw it away, nothing there. Defender in the face. Second down and 10, 2.33 to go in the half. Over the middle to Jeremy Shockey, breaks a tackle and is above the 40 yard line to about the 43. Backpedaling, decides to run and gonna take off with it. And take an absolutely vicious hit. Vic is just getting clobbered out here. Second down and in inches, finds Jeremy Shockey and we're into Philadelphia territory with 138 on the clock. Scrambling to the right. Finds Anquan Bolin over the middle. Back body dropped at the 15 yard line. 115 on the clock. Vic over the middle to Rudy Johnson. Gets us down inside the 10 yard line with less than a minute to go in the half. Corner of the end zone. Touchdown show. The rookie Lance Moore back there. Way to diagnose the defense there. And the Kurt Warner jackets do not approve. It is 34 degrees at this game. It's a chilly one. Extra point, you know what that means? We're gonna shank it, golly. And I gotta tell you, my hand is hurting and I think it's from the kick meter. Picked off! Keith Newman, he's still going! Down inside the five yard line. Keith Newman, two more interceptions in this game. That's four in the last three games for the Vegas linebacker. Can we add to the lead? Okay, it's not there, <laughs> throw it away. Taking another hit. 31 seconds on the clock. Vic going to have his pass batted out of the air. Third down and goal, 27 seconds, and just gives it right to another guy with no name. Did the research, found out who he was, but I've since forgotten. I do apologize. I can let you know who it is later on. And that is Prince of Darkness calling me out on my research. Lance Moore, big kick return to open up the second half. And here comes the Vegas with nice field position and that pass over the middle, batted out of the air. Second down and 10, play action, runs into another sack. Third down and 14, gonna roll out to the left, uh, get it to Rudy Johnson, but he's gonna be well short of the line to gain three and out, go the Vegas show to start the second half. Corell Buckhalter, flag on the play, Dan Campbell, the Lions coach holding, Backs him up to the six yard line. It's first and 14. Buck Halter runs into Keith Newman. Hello, Newman. Second down and 15. Buck Halter only gets a couple yards on that one. So it's third down and 13. Bowler from the goal line finds Dan Campbell. And he more than makes up for that holding penalty. Hand off to Buck Halter and not going anywhere because he runs into Ebenezer Ekubon. Great name. Buck Halter this time runs into Asante Samuel. Third down and seven play action. Flicks this one out and it's into double coverage. Falls incomplete. Punt the ball back to the Las Vegas show. Reggie Wayne somehow comes up with that. And just like that, we're across the 50 yard line. Play action. Going deep downfield to the fullback. Rock Cartwright. Boy, I love that play. It works more times than not. Over the middle, pass batted out of the air. Second down and 10, Vic under pressure, got three green jerseys coming after him and throws it out of bounds. Third down and 10, backpedaling, decides to run with it. Wide open field, inside the 10, the five, and out of bounds at the one yard line. First and goal, we're going play action, got a defender right on his tail, and it is Jerry Porter, Joey Porter, excuse me, with the sack. Second down and goal, gonna run to the outside. Got running room, just take it. Touchdown, show. Okay, finally put it into the end zone. How many times have we seen this replay before? This time, the Philly version. Two point conversion, let's get up by three scores. Vic scrambling to the left and it's gonna fall incomplete. Looking for Rudy Johnson. 2.31 to go in the third quarter. It's 22 to seven and Corell Buckhalter putting on the moves. Gets him above the 40 yard line. Bowler to throw on first down. 
And he's gonna find Givens, I forgot his first name, gets him above the 45 yard line into Vegas territory, Buck Halter. Gets him inside the 40, third down and four. Play action, finds Dan Campbell, and Philly got something going on this drive, it appears. Flicks this one out to Givens. They're down inside the 10 yard line with 29 seconds to go in the third quarter. Going end zone, batted out of the air and into the hands of Jamarius Butler. Sammy Davis with the volleyball spike finds his teammate and what an interception that is. Vegas gets the ball here and when you have an interception, the play clock is 25 seconds instead of 40. Hence the delay of game penalty because I was busy looking at the replay trying to get that sick thumbnail. End of the third quarter, 22-7. to Vegas looking for their fourth straight win. Can we get it done? Diving attempt from Reggie Wayne. No dice. Third down and nine. Rolling out to the left and finding Jeremy Shockey above the 35-yard line. Vegas. Handoff. No. Play action. Rolling out to the right. Green jerseys in front of us and finds Jeremy Shockey. Uh, Vic the Magician. Good thing he's got the magic hat on the helmet. It makes a lot of sense. Second down and four. Chris Brown with a carry. It's going to get us the first down. Put in the faster running back for that play. Going to scramble to the left and push the wrong button. Rudy Johnson going to lose three yards on that one. Second and 13 outside. Falls incomplete. Looking for Reggie Wayne, but he's surrounded by green jerseys. Third down and 13, and it's picked off by Samari Roll. Second interception. It was so good. Last week, we didn't have any turnovers. Two in this one. Dan Campbell with the catch. Life for the Philadelphia Freedom. Caught by Robinson inside the Vegas 40 with 3.42 on the clock. Corell Buckhalter spins, gets five yards at second and five. Kyle Bowler looking, flicks this one outside to Buckhalter. They're down inside the 25 yard line with just over three minutes to go in this one. Caught by Robinson, breaks a tackle. Touchdown, Freedom. And they have a chance to make this a one score game and they are going for two now instead of later no they'll have to do later and it's Corell Buckhalter we're lined up for the onside kick instead they decide to kick it off Lance Moore goes back gets it catches it at the four he's up past the 30 up past the 40 and gets knocked down at the 48 yard line all we got to do is run out these three minutes Vic, safety blitz is going to put a thorn in those plans. Got to throw it out of bounds. Second and 10. Vic, got wide open field this time. And he's going to dive down inches short of the line to gain. We're going to do the quarterback sneak. And he is going to get it. Doesn't say fourth down. So Vegas with the ball here coming out of the two minute warning. Scrambling to the left. And running and turning into a Vic sandwich. Another big hit. Philly calls their first timeout with 155 on the clock. Rudy Johnson gonna get the first down. Philly calls timeout number two. Got the clock down to 108. Rudy Johnson near the line to gain. They call their final timeout. It's gonna be third down and three for the Las Vegas show. Throwing. Lance Moore caught and he's inches short of line to gain. We're going to let the clock run all the way down and then trot out Janikowski for a 35-yard field goal is good. 20 seconds on the clock. That should do it. Last chance for Philly. Launching it and caught by Marcus Robinson with seven seconds to go. They got no timeouts. Can they get another play off? Two, one, boom. Ball game. Vegas. I think we got this thing figured out, fellas. Four straight. We are dominant on the road. 10-2 and two in our two seasons. Let's not go back home. Let's just keep this road warrior thing going. I, I like how this is going. 6-2 and two at the halfway point. Five turnovers in this game. Two from the Vegas show. Don't like to see that. Vic, 20 of 34 for 201 yards. Two touchdowns. Two interceptions. That's 13 interceptions on the year. One behind the leader, Matt Hasselbeck. 
Kyle Bowler had three picks in this one, 13 to 22 for 190 yards. Corel Buckhalter, a cool 100 yards on 17 carries. Vic, 71 yards and a touchdown on his rushing day. Jeremy Shockey, seven catches, 85 yards and a touchdown. Lance Moore, also a touchdown. And Marcus Robinson, a touchdown, four catches for 89 yards. Keith Newman, two interceptions in this one, two a couple weeks ago. He's got five on the year, which is one off the top mark. Champ Bailey there in a three-way tie with six. Ravagers win. They're five and four, beating the Brawlers. Crush win. They're five and three, beating the Baltimore Knights. And the San Diego Fleet, six and two, just like us, defeating the Boston Navigators, who are two and six. Next up, we got Kansas City uh, winning despite Bulger's three picks over San Jose. And that is stop number five on this six game road trip if that's what you want to call it all right guys we're on a roll let's keep this thing going let me know your thoughts on this game down in the comments below and i'll see you at the next show